Greetings and salutations, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Darkest Eclipse, and welcome to Hunt Showdown. Uh, this game had a free weekend to celebrate the new launch of its latest update, Hunt 1896. So I managed to convince Grimms to give it a try. This is my personal favorite out of the extraction genre kind of game. You play as bounty hunters in typically the Louisiana Swamp. However, the uh, game is now taking place in Colorado for a month until everyone kind of gets used to the new map and how some of the new systems work. So I do apologize if some of this seems kind of tutorial-y or I'm explaining a lot of things in this video. I'm kind of explaining it to Grimm's so he gets a handle on it because it's his first time playing and this game has a lot of weird quirks to it. Thank you all so much for watching and on to the video. I don't know what that scream was, but it didn't sound good. Uh, looks like the clue is up there. Oh, here's an enemy. This thing's called a hive. So it'll, if it sees you and reacts, it'll just start throwing bugs at you. Um, and you'll notice its head is on its back, so it's kind of hard to headshot in a fight. Um, so if you want to just pop its head off, go for it. If you can see it. I don't got an angle. Oh, it just... I had one and then it went behind the fucking thing. Alright. Um, lanterns, if they're lit, can be... Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, hey, there's an armor. They're resistant to most kinds of damage. Um, there's an ammo box here only for compact rounds. There's three types of... or four types of ammo in the game. There's compact, uh, medium cartridge, here's the uh, large cartridge, and then shock shells. Oh, hello. Oh. Nice. Okay. He's gonna set us on fire. I'm just gonna let's just keep that door. He closed it right as I threw it. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't know you were gonna throw it at him. I was gonna say let's just keep that nice and closed. Is that an emulator? Sounds like an emulator. It is, I don't see it. I just see a lot of fire, which I think you... Oh, it is. Hi. Okay, so don't shoot this guy or hit him with your knife. Fucker. Yeah, he does that. <laughs> Sorry, you said don't shoot. I had to shoot. Yeah. Well, now he's pissy. Shit. How do you... Ah, I'm burning. Ash him. I'm trying to. Now, how, how do you... Hold V. You... Hold V. He's down. Fuck. I lost a health chunk. Yes, that's why we don't shoot emulators. Oh. Yeah. This stuff here will unlock... Uh... Oh. Hang on. Grab this. It'll unlock the next item in your weapons category. Oh, yes, I just unlocked the gun I want. Um, so if you look in the top left where the assassin is in the top one, uh, notice how there's still a mark? That means whoever killed it was a solo player and there's still a bounty token. So we might be able to go get that. Poggy Woggy. What up? I said Poggy Woggy. <laughs> Careful when you jump. Ow. <laughs> so now that there's no more clues, if you hold Dark Sight, it'll show where the monster banished from. Ah. Oh, shit.
we're clear. When you have a bounty, you can see uh, enemies just by looking around in dark sight. So I've got four seconds left. And if you look at the map, do you see where there's kind of little marks around the edges? Like the little arrow pointing out? Those are exfil spots. Everyone has the same ones. So if there's other players and they just saw us pick up a bounty, they're like, all right, they're probably going to one of these. Which we are. But we'll make money. Oh, fuck that. That armor just covered in barbed wire. It's setting him on fire. Actually, not a bad idea. <laughs> Fuck, water devils. I forgot about you fuckers. Yes, that's why you don't I, use worms I, I to fish. Uh, it's, over here. it's a boat! Okay, we should now be I clear. Pull it in the back of your head. <laughs> Is that the penny shot there, Andrew? That thing's fucking hilarious looking. If you press I, you can inspect. Did I know that? Alright, so we got a bounty. It means we'll get more money. It's a veterly. Have you ever heard of the wolf attachment for like Enfield rifles? Nope. Okay, it basically turned or er, bolt action sniper rifles into semiotics or semi-automatics because it would use the gas pressure from firing to just straight pull the bolt back since that's all you need on the end field i'll set you the low a threat or a promise maybe both <laughs> hey yeah <laughs> yeah i agree butcher is kind of hard he, he's a hard one random boss in diablo He's a hard random boss for Homelander to fight, too. Oh, hey, hi. Oh, I get to test out the Obras. If she turns. You know what? Let's just see what happens when I hit her with one of these rooms. I push her off the walkway. <laughs> oh, so cool thing. If you hold E, notice how the scrap beak's flashing? Yeah, we're at the scrap beak. Oh. And just spawned us here. I'm going to grab the clue, because that'll still give us a little money. You know what? We're gonna kill this bitch quick, actually. Hang on. You're gonna love this. So he is super weak to explosives, but he won't... Dr the way his fight is supposed to work is after you do a certain amount of damage, he explodes barbed wire everywhere, but then in that barbed wire there's, like, medical supplies and ammo and stuff. But if you throw explosives at him, then he won't drop it because it'll all break. Um... Nice. We're gonna just throw bombs at him. Because it does a fuck ton of damage. And I have, like, a bundle of dynamite and two frag grenades. I've and a wax dynamite stick. Alright, there you go. You're gonna love his design, actually, I think. Where you at, big boy? It's over here. There he is. Look at him! He's such a fella. Can you, uh, cook the frig? Yeah. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, just throw it whenever you're ready. You somehow managed to cut me with that through the wall. Hi there. Hello. That's good. Okay, apparently it doesn't do as much damage as it used to. Either that or he fucked off a little because we went upstairs. He might have done that. Um, also, when you're in dark sight, when it's flashing white, that means there's no enemy hunters nearby. If it starts flashing red, there's enemies.
Fuck, I keep forgetting. Oh my god. Keep moving. You're gonna want to run fast. I think upstairs is safe, he can't follow us up here, I don't think. God, I keep doing that. I keep forgetting that when I reload this thing, it's gonna eject around. I have to do that early. Uh, I'm gonna check his barbed wire for ammo and stuff. You can clear barbed wire, by the way, by melee attacking it but that's only if you want to get, like, real close. Watch it, watch it! Ow! No! Ah, oh, he fucking iced me. Okay. I would run upstairs and hide. And then if you can get to me and res me. If not, just kill him because he's low on health. Oh, he like booby trapped me. Bleeding can escalate, by the way. So be very careful when you're just doing that. Oh god. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Well done. Ugh. Okay. It's fine. And then when we start banishing him, we'll get a, or a restock effect. And I'll walk into barbed wire again. Got her. I got smacked. Did they just rush I think you also managed to kill them. I think they stepped on the bear trap. One's rushing the bounty. Got her. One's up top. Ow. Sorry.
Great. Nice and easy. Can walk a little ways. Just walking is still significantly quieter than sprinting. There he is. Right there. Yep. Yes. Nice. If we loot him, we'll both get an extra second of dark sense, which is gonna be fucking insanely helpful. Okay, what do you have? Berthier, a Scottfield. Scottfield's actually a pretty good pistol. It's one of my favorites. Oh, and an ammo crate right here. Okay, I'm burning my second. There's no one around. We'll get to exfil. Wait a few seconds during it. And then we'll use yours. Head over this way. That's a good fucking round. Do you want to use yours and just skin around real quick? Nobody. Perfect! Yes! Oh, that feels great! Boom! You don't know how badly I wanted to shoot you at the last second. <laughs> <laughs> oh, trust me, I'm well aware.